Hey folks, this is Jason Good with the Good Life Outdoors. I'm out here at the Chaparral Wildlife Management Area in South Texas. Uh, we came down to be uh, standby for the javelina hunt that we do every year and we got chosen. Um, uh, pretty much everybody who was here for stand standby was able to get in. So we have our compartment. We're going to start hunting here. Looks like a pretty good spot. Uh, the weather's cooperating. It's nice and sunny. Um, it was pretty cold this morning, but I think that's supposed to warm out through this weekend. But uh, we're here to kill some javelinas, possibly some feral hogs, and maybe even some warthogs. So stick around, we'll see what happens. All right, I'm in the blind using one of the blinds here from the uh, wildlife management area. It's a pretty neat area. I'm overlooking a small pond. I've got views pretty far around. This is usually a pretty uh, pretty brushy place. You usually don't have wide open expanses. And this is an interesting mix of wide open area surrounded by some really thick brush. So I think we've got a pretty good chance of, of seeing something. Uh, just have to see how it plays out. We were here for three days last year. It was super cold. We saw nothing. Um, so hopefully this year our luck will change. So we'll uh, we'll give it a go and, and see what comes out. And I will have you all along for the ride. Okay, shots fired. A uh, one of the guys that we we're hunting with. Uh, killed a javelina. Um, been out here for, well, I guess he may have been set up maybe an hour and a half. So that's a good sign. They are moving. They are here. They're in the area. So it's a real good sign. Um, hopefully, uh, hopefully got a good shot. Was able to uh, recover it. So we shall see. But we're going to keep on hunting until it gets dark here, and then go from there. All right, we're two for four on javelinas. Four guys hunting, second guy just shot his. We've been here less than two hours in the stand. And we already have two on the ground, so that's uh, it's pretty good for a group of four. Uh, I'm hoping to see a lot more. I haven't seen anything moving in my area, so I still think it's a good spot. And I'm just gonna just wait it out and see what shows up. Well, it's getting close to end of the shooting time. I still have seen absolutely nothing, which is surprising because this looks like a really good spot. Um, my dad has seen a javelina at least, and a bobcat. Hasn't had an opportunity to shoot yet. But I am seeing nothing. So, give it until the last reasonable shooting time and then we'll head in and try again tomorrow. Some shots fired. A group of pigs came out and it sounded like a hit on the first one. They ran, another one came back. I definitely put that one on the ground. So, got some pigs down over there. So, that uh, at least some blood drawn here. I'm, I'm pretty excited. That's, uh, that's pretty neat. I'm looking over here to see if they're going to come back out. But, uh, cool. All right. Let's go see uh, what we see over there. Hopefully there's some obvious blood. Um, there's one that's certainly down on the ground, so very, very cool. All righty, got at least one piggy on the ground. Little tiny one. 
So he's gonna be good eating. I look for some more blood. Once I get a stronger light, this headlamp isn't uh, giving me a whole lot of a whole lot of light to look by. All right, we're back at the hotel, and we did find the other pig. It was a pretty big one. Didn't take any pictures of that because we were just trying to get back to the check station. But uh, yeah, pretty exciting. Got to shoot a couple pigs, get those off the land. Um, again, we had two of our guys take javelinas, so just down to my dad and I to get our javelinas before the end of the hunt. We've got two more days. We'll see how we do. We'll see you all in the morning. Hey, good morning. Yeah, got a little bit of sleep last night. We're back at it. It is a beautiful, chilly morning out here. And we're going to hit it hard today, see what we can see. Um, I ended up getting the two pigs last night. And uh, sorry, I wasn't able to get much of that on camera. We were needing to get back to the check station because they, uh, those guys need to go home at some point in time, and uh, we were out a little late trying to find my second pig. So, anyway, we got that done, and we're back out here in the blinds. Uh, I'm set up in the same spot. So is my dad. Um, he hasn't shot anything yet, so he did see a javelina come in last night. Just didn't get close enough for him to make a comfortable shot. So, we're going to see what comes in today. Uh, but really looking forward to it. It's supposed to be a little warmer today, which hopefully means the animals will be moving around. And we'll just take it as it comes. Just love being out here. It's just beautiful out here. Take a look at the sunrise. Yeah, it's just, just pretty, pretty country out here. seen anything this morning so I'm out kind of exploring the area thought I caught a little whiff of javelinas they're pretty powerful smell so winds kind of up there you probably hear it in the camera but um, just gonna keep kind of cruising around this area and just see if I can pick up a scent or see any movement been a slow day of hunting haven't seen anything move none of the other guys have seen anything move so just one of those things you know it seems like a good day for us a little warmer today it's sunny um, just nothing moving right now so I'm kind of wandering the perimeter of the area I'm hunting just to see if I can smell anything or see anything so we'll just kind of keep after it and go from there but yeah have something on the ground by now today, but such is life. One of the guys texted and spotted a javelina. Now he's one, he's already shot one, so I'm gonna head over his way and see if I can uh, stalk it down, so.
right more success. So got the text that there was a howling over in another area. Went over there and set up. The howling had been coming in and out of the uh, bushes. So as we got over there, I guess it had gone back into the bushes so we could met up with the folks we're hunting with. And waited and waited and had the camera set up. Wanted to have my dad take a shot and me get it on camera. Decided it wasn't going to come back out, so we were going to split up. He was going to stay there and continue to hunt while I went back to another spot. And as soon as we got back to the truck, we hear a shot. And the Havilland doesn't come back out right after we left, so yeah, good times. Didn't get a ca didn't catch it on camera, but my dad is successful, and that's the important part. So very cool. I'm going walking over to a spot right now, and we've seen some over here before, so we're going to see if they come back out. So stay tuned. Hey, good morning. It's the last day of the hunt. So far our group has killed three javelinas. I've shot two pigs. So it's been a pretty good hunt. Um, had a little action last night. I was able to stock up on some but could not seal the deal so they are in the area. But uh, yeah, it's been a great hunt so far. We still have today to try to finish things out. So. We're going to play it by ear. I'm in the same stand over the pond that I've been in. And my plan is hopefully they'll come out here. If they don't, the other folks who have already gotten javelinas will uh, text me if they see some by their area. And I'm ready to just kind of run over there and give it a go and uh, stalk on them. Whichever area they show up. So we're going to give it our best shot. My other hunters called me over to this area. He'd seen some crossing the road. But by the time I got over there, they had gone. Didn't see him come back out. While we were standing there, another one crossed and uh, wasn't able to get a shot. So they're not cooperating, but got a little bit more time. We'll keep after it. Well, folks, that's going to do it. We're uh, we're calling it. Going to be heading home here pretty soon. We've got all our, our blinds and gear packed up and about to head up to the check station. Um, my dad and I are going to skin out my pig and his javelina and then uh, get on the road and go back up uh, north. But uh, this was a it was a great hunt, you know. For all four people who we were hunting with, all of us got something. Um, three javelinas, two hogs and just a whole lot of fun. Uh, Texas Parks and Wildlife puts on a great hunt. The folks here at the Chaparral Wildlife Management Area do a great job with their hunts. So, appreciate you following along. I hope you like what you saw. If you did, give me a thumbs up. 
If you want to see more videos, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And if you do subscribe, hit that notification button so you know when I post new videos. Now, I really appreciate each and every one of you for following along. Y'all get out there and live the good life. Thanks a lot.